Hi, I'm Melon from Battle Wars Gaming, and yes, we're back into some gigantic, this time with a truly gigantic hero, the McGrave. Excuse me, no one's going to react her. Excuse me. Anyways, the McGrave is your uh, quintessential, and I said that right, huzzah, tank. He's got a lot of health, he's a little bit slow, uh, and his abilities are his demon punch, demon punch, right? Demon fist, normal melee attack, hellburst, a shield that does fire damage, his charge, and an E. Now, E is the most important important thing with blunt trauma because I love stuns if you have friends and all that other stuff I believe that you should always take a stun there it is and this is why you always take stuns maybe all right the McGrave is coming in and he doesn't give a shit what you want Okay, you have your E up! Go! Go with the E! Alright, I'm up. I'm really deep, and I think I should leave. I've decided that I am uh, a little little too deep here. I've got no health. Um, I'm immediately going to go into my Demonic Fist with a powerful final combo. Why? Because, well, more damage is more good, baby! Come on, Beckett. Yeah, you gotta go. Alright, I do have my E up. Where the hell is this? Boom! And you can't stop the McGrave. I'm also going to immediately go straight up into a bigger, more critical blow. Now, my final here is... Rock and Roll, baby! I'll protect my team with my shield, take a step back. Actually pick up Stonewall, so I'm immune to critical hits. Now, as I have said a lot of times, man... Alright, she's gonna get away. She's going to try to shoot me. It's probably not gonna work out as well for her as she thinks, and I'm probably super dead. Oh yeah, I am super dead. <laughs> yeah, you know what? What's my efficiency? 7-0? I'll take it. I've gone in pretty heavy. I've gone ham, and that's kind of my uh, playstyle with the McGrave. Uh, his ultimate is Ground and Pound, a martial art move that I have never used in my entire life. That's like 16 years of martial arts. 17 years of martial arts. <laughs> This is also, you never, never want to summon up top. I'm just going to say this, never do it. Anyways. Now, right now, my my primary concern, I'm looking at my enemy team. We've got a couple of ranged attacks. we got mostly ranged attacks. So I'm going to go up into my hell shield that gives me... Oh. Boom! Oh, you have made a terrible choice. I'm just saying. There's my revenge. Okay, come on, Wu. Please have your tongue up. Please have your tongue up. Nope, wow. I get it. I understand. I know what's happening here. I hate trying to get the, uh... Wound on these power gems from way up here. But, sometimes you gotta steal power. And sometimes you gotta be cool. And sometimes you gotta kill a Vodin. Three and four. Okay, we got the enemy guardian coming in. I should go. Okay, come on, come on. I'm super dead here, but maybe I got a kill on the way out. No, <laughs> I got someone super low though. If my team does not pick that up. I'm gonna be very upset. I'm gonna be. V I am very upset. Like seriously, she had no health, or he had no health. That's all right. Um, I'm always going to go in back crater here. Um, I have a stun. If I can get more people or have less likelihood of uh, landing a poor stun, I'm going to hellburst for twice as long. Like super dead. Not even gonna. Not even gonna laugh about it, man. Yeah, I know what you're saying, man. We got to go back and help out. Our creature before they kill it because this is actually I'm gonna block it. I'm gonna I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna stun. I'm gonna try and interrupt I'm gonna stand in front of my creature take all of these shots block. Come on, baby. You don't stand a ghost of a chance There it is Yeah, you don't want to try to fight him a grave standing in your face 
Um, I'm going to go into Give Him Hell, which reflects the shots back, because if anything, we've just proven that, uh, that HK is going to just stand there and shoot. Yeah. How about you play this way? I'm going to stop you from coming in and helping out your friends here. Okay, that missed. You know what? This is why you never summon on enemy points. Ah! I got nuked. <laughs> Did we get a kill off of it at least? Maybe. That's the fake one, and maybe he can... There it is. We got a push. I would love to get a wound. Another wound. We're doing pretty damn well. So right now, if you can notice, every one of my abilities is pretty much for me going ham on. Uh, death is pretty nasty right now. I've got jumps, I got I got my uh, charges, I got everything that really uh, incentivizes me going in like a friggin' beast. No, like, you don't get to live. I don't think you get it. Oh, it's Prince Vega. Uh, pretty good player. I don't want to fight him like this because I'm just going to get that. Oh, look at the amount of hands he's got out. Oh, I hate this. Oh, God. Please stop, Vega. Oh, God. I said, please stop, Vega. He didn't get stabbed because my jump kind of bullshit it out. <laughs> Did you see that? The air time? There is one problem I have with, uh... Friggin' my jump sometimes. I had, like, a 30-minute jump there. And it did not land where I was hoping it to land. <laughs> I just was floating up there and I'm like, Vega, stop shooting me, dude. Stop shooting me. Nope, nope, they absolutely would not stop shooting me. I'm glad Vega's dead. I like him as a guy, but... He plays pretty damn well. Oh, I would love, nope, to be able to help. But that ain't happen. Oh, hello. What do we have up here? Oh god, he's not dead! He's not dead! <laughs> Go ahead, shoot me! Shoot me! Shoot me! Alright, I'm super dead. <laughs> I got really kind of, uh, I don't want to say cocky, but, uh, I began pushing really hard on that. I got greedy, and I, I paid for it, honestly. I gotta I gotta pull back a hair. You know what, if my friends are taking down a adult creature, we could get a push if they can kill it in time. Oh. Yeah, about that. No! And there's a kill! Oh my god, he's out again! He's outing, my friends. Ah, uh, I hate it. Ah, uh, this thing burns. I will summon here. Or oh, do I upgrade? Do I don't have an upgrade ability? Like, this is just stupid. Um, uh, these things don't get to live here. All right, so, so Vega just went underground, but, oh, and he's out. I'd like to go Q for the interrupt. I'm going to go up into, uh, let me get speed so that I can continue hitting people and chasing them pretty well. Oh my god, what, don't summon on the caverns! Ah. Uh. I'm out. I'm out here. I'm out. I don't want to be here anymore. But if you can kill this bull before he kills one of us, that would be outstanding. Oh my god, yup. Maybe uh, some of the, one of my friends escaped from that. Again, if you have more creatures than the enemy, uh, going especially going to clash, you're going to build up power a lot quicker. It's a good idea to always have 
more creatures, more higher level creatures than your enemy. Look, if we can get this uh, creature kill, what do we actually have down there? Ah, uh, too much. Too much. No, no bueno. I chased him too hard. Don't deal with that. Knock down their creature instead. It actually will get net you quite a bit of uh, power f to uh, in this push. Oh, excuse me. Oh my god. I cannot believe that. At least we got the push. It might grant us the win. Look, a simple, you know, dying to get a, uh, an objective is not a bad thing. I thought for sure I could get out, but... They also only have one creature, which is outstanding when we're really... Oh, man. Prince Vega's doing damn well. Man, and we cannot get this wound. <laughs> oh, that's terrible for us. Oh my god, I was so deep! And look how far away all of our friends are. <laughs> this is... You, you, you gotta be with your friends, man. We lost a creature, which now does not tie us. We're still ahead by one, but just barely. We're probably gonna get pushed on. If you wanna know the... Now nah, that's dead. Okay, I got I got interrupted, which is terrible for me. I wasted my friggin' shield. All right, we gotta push. Uh, enemy guardian is vulnerable. Let's hit Vega up here. Let's murder him. Like we must. I'm gonna actually go into my Q, which has the toss back. I believe that it's one of the best abilities, because I can now pull someone back who thinks they're out. That's dead. Is there an enemy up here? There definitely is not an enemy. Uh, there's only one en one of their enemies dead, so what we need to do is just withdraw. Yeah, you just go! All right, he should be... S no! That's dead. All right, at death's door, we got a kill. Uh, we got the hell back, and we win this push here. Like, that's what this this time is. I'm actually going to go super deep with my jump. Super deep with this jump. I'm just going to stand here and take everything that, that my en the enemy team can throw at me. Huzzah! The Muggrave! If you ain't ham, you ain't damned. Actually, you probably don't want to be damned. You don't. Well, you know what? He's got a devil, de devil hand. So you know what? Absolutely, want to be damned. Be like the McGrave kids. Kill a demon and put it on your arm. I'm Melon from Battle Gaming. If you enjoyed this, let's look at it and kind of like how I play McGrave. Uh, please subscribe if you want to see more. That is, and if you uh, enjoyed the video, hit the like button. I completely goofed this in exit or outro. Or whatever you want to call it. I'm just too pumped from the McGrave who missed leg day and it has nothing but bulky arms that rip people to shreds. Melon from Bad West Gaming, signing out.